What is up everyone? We are here with a new Let's Play playthrough of Dragon Warrior 3 for the NES. I have never played this. This is going to be a blind playthrough. As were my first uh, two Dragon Warrior games. Um, I'll get more into that here in a second. Uh, we have a little intro here it looks like. that are hero fighting what looks like Trogdor. Now I did play through like the first like 10-15 minutes of this just to kind of get a quick little grasp of it um, but did not do much in the realm of uh, playing too far into it. Cut off a wing. Stabbed it through the chest. And they both fall into the volcano. Oh, okay, so this explains the opening bit of the story. Okay. I did not let it do this. So uh, this will explain what sets up the beginning of the story of the game. And then once again, we are greeted here with the uh, Dragon Warrior three screen. Is that it? We can advance forward. I think so. We're gonna begin a new quest. And once again we are going to be Iggy. We'll be male. We'll just keep it at four. It was Iggy's 16th birthday. Wake up, dear. Wake up, Iggy. Wake up, Iggy. It's morning. Today is a very important day. This is the first time that you, Iggy, shall go to the castle. I have raised you as a brave young lad for this very day. So come with your mother. Catchy music already. If you go straight, you'll come to the castle. Remember your manners in front of the king. All right, be on your way. Welcome to the castle of a lion. Alihan. Uh, we do have some locked doors here we cannot get through. Um, you can see we have the same setup from the Dragon Warrior 2 with talk status search spell item equip. Again, not having to worry about stairs and all that fun stuff. They say that the key made by their by the thief Bakor can it easily open all doors with simple locks. The thief Bakor, who once wreaked havoc in this town, is now in jail, so we need to start our notes already. So Bakor has the thief key. Thief key. Uh, these doors again are locked, cannot get in those. Didn't you see the princess? My princess, my princess. Okay. This person here. I cannot go out because of the Archfiend. I don't think I can stand it anymore every day like this. We need it every day like this. Okay, we're gonna walk through here. I did not explore all of the castle last time, so I basically just went up and talked to the king. Oh. Blasted. That blasted old man in the Tower of Najima. He stole a key from me, Bakor. Oh, so... He... 
I'm assuming Thief be stolen by old man the Tower of Luigi. You want to talk to a prisoner, you have to do it through the bars. This guy ever come over? Yep. Keep coming down. You can see a lot of reused sprites. Thank you. Anyway, you don't have the key to open the jail. Get away from here. Okay. Yeah, we can't get through there either. They've done a good job of updating some of these sprites. But yes, we do have some reused assets from the previous two games. Who's that outside? Uh, I can't get through the door to talk to him, so I guess I won't know. Nope. Rumor has it that you can go from the cave on the pro uh, promontory to the Tower of Nojiva. Eve on the promontory. Promontory goes to Tower of Regina. Um, I meant to read through the manual before playing this but I got too excited so I'll probably do that in between uh, videos and these guys just welcome me too His Highness is upstairs when you return from your travels have the results of your labors recorded in the Imperial Scrolls of Honor that way, even if you rest from your journey for a while, you can restore your status. Don't forget to save. Brave hero, please bring peace to the world quickly. Castle gates close at night. You can only have an audience with the king during the day. So that's another thing about this game that I've seen is that there's a day and night cycle. That's awesome. In a fight, the farther back you stand, the less damage you incur. Pay attention to the formation so we can have forward and backwards formation. Equip yourself with a weapon and armor and ready yourself. It's not enough that you have them, so don't forget to equip your stuff after you get it. Solo journey is too dangerous. It's too dangerous to go alone. Take this. Uh, it's best to go to Luisa's place at the west edge of town and find some companions. Welcome unto the Iggy, son of the brave Ortega. It is said that thy father Ortega made his end when he fell into a volcano's crater at the end of a battle. So that's what we saw there, that little uh, introduction cutscene. We do hereby accept your petition to follow in the footsteps of your brave father. Thy enemy shall be the archfiend Baramus. So we just get an enemy. <laughs> I'm almost back quick note of that. Enemy is Arch and Arlos. The name of the Archfiend Baramos is yet unknown in the world of men. We don't know his name. Things remain unchanged before long the world will be destroyed by the Archfiend. Aramus must be defeated. Seek companions at the local eatery and start your quest. Did you receive money for his party? Farewell, until we meet once more. So yeah, we can hire people. I think that's neat. Because now there's a true class system in the game. You walk along the ocean from the castle, you'll come to a uh, so to a cave on the promontory. If you walk along the ocean, from the castle, 
you will find a lemon. Which we need to go through to get to find that key. Because that takes us to the Tower of Najima. Door just open. Oh, it's goodbye close at night is my guess. Are you the son of the brave Ortega? Your father was a great man. Thank you. Store deals in weapons and armor. What do we got? We have the cypress stick, the club, copper sword, clothes, wayfarers, clothes, leather armor, leather shield. We have 50 gold, so we don't have a whole lot. We have a well over here, it looks like. Hast, uh, hast thou seen the island floating to the west of the castle? No. You should see it as soon as you go outside. As if I say yes. That upon which you see rising up on that island is the Tower of Najima, okay? Search. Oh, can't use the well. If you go out of town and walk for a long time, by and by you'll reach the edge of night. So does time not pass while you're in the towns? When I'm here in town, the idea that the Archfiend will destroy the world seems impossible. This is where we heal and resurrect. Alihan is a continent surrounded by the sea. But I hear there are bigger continents beyond the sea. At your service, my good people, so we can uncurse, detoxicate, and revive. Nope. Shop deals and tools. What do we have here? Medical, antidote, wing of wyvern. Okay. Alahan once reigned over the entire world, then came a war in which many lost their lives. At that time, the travel door connecting across the ocean was closed off. Let's go back into our house. This is our grandfather. Your father Ortega was a great hero, and my son. Yeah, you, dude, you're my grandfather. Welcome back, Iggy, my dear. You must be exhausted. Sit down and rest. So we can rest for free? Good morning. Time to get up and go, Iggy. Just a free rest for us. Interesting. So don't use the N. Well, maybe. We talk to you. This is the castle town of Alahan. If you go north, you'll come to the village of Reed. North of Alahan is town, the village of Reed. This is the vault. Oh yeah, I saw this as well. You can, you can uh, leave items here. You can store gold, which is cool, because if you die, then you don't lose your gold, right? If you're going to take anyone along, and you, you'd best take a soldier, a pilgrim, and a wizard. Pick up. So they're recommending soldier, pilgrim, and wizard. That's where we recruit the people. Oof-offs are really useless. If you want to take one along, wait until you get it strong and take one along just for laughs. Sages are a chosen few. Only those few who can withstand the rigorous training can become sages. Now yeah, we have cats instead of dogs, apparently. This is the Adventurer's Hall of Registration. I can register anyone you wish to include among your companions. Once you register them here, you may depart with them from the eatery downstairs. Uh, yes. Sure. Um. Let's go with... So who we going to bring with us? Ned. 
will be a... Let's, let's take the people they said. Let's do the soldier, the pilgrim, and the wizard. So Ned's gonna be a soldier. He'll be male. Okay. Sure. Uh, let's see. For our pilgrim... female wizard um Now we can go downstairs and get them. I'm assuming. Add a member. Oh, so they have pre made people too. Okay. Another world. sword, leather armor. Okay. Um, so... We're gonna go to Reeve first. Let's see what our grinding options are out here. Slimes? Those are sl Oh, they're slimes. We have four black ravens, too. Fine. Raven. We have spells. Blaze. And you can heal. One dead slime. No, we don't have spells, okay. Um, fight the slime. Blaze, fight the slime. No, oh, leave rain alone. Party members gain 10 experience points. You obtain 50 pieces of gold. So can we save in my house? Or rest in my house and gain our hit points back? Or do we have to do that in the end? Because Rain took a beating. I do like how each of the characters have like their own custom sprite. Welcome back. 
The exhaust is at our rest. Your friend should come in and rest too. Morning time to get up and go. So are we all healed? We are. That's awesome. So don't use the end. Not here at least. Got it. Let's go back to the castle for a second. So if I know anything about this game, we are going to want to do a quick little early grind. I think we're going to grind up to level 3. Let's see where we're at experience-wise. Sight work 19 more points. Ned needs 2. Rain needs 5. Matt needs 4. Uh, yes. Yes, we're going to continue our journey. Okay, so I'm going to do a quick grind up to level 3. And then we'll be, uh, we'll be back. And then I think we'll make our way up to Reeve next. So I'll see you guys back at level 3. And we are back. Uh, so, the main hero is only level 2 while everybody else is level 3 because it's going to take as much to get him to level 3 as it'll take everybody else to level 4. Uh, so I'm not messing with that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and explore north and try to see if we can find this village of Reeve. Uh, we did gain a new spell for Matt. He has a spell. I'm not sure if I can... Condition... Oh. Status... Info. There we go. There we go. Here's the spell, and I also picked up a spell. Uh, formation. Please. Okay, so we want to go to the north. There it is. Yeah, but everybody else needs roughly about the same amount of experience I need to go. They were able to go from 1 to 2, and to what's going to get them to go to 4 is what it takes for me to go from, you know, to 2 to 3. So I'm assuming this is Reeve. Hmm, nice little music. Welcome to the village of Reeve. When you walk outside of town, you may encounter things in some suspicious places. It's not good enough to look from a distance, get up real close. Okay. Good afternoon, welcome to the Wayfarer's Inn. This eight pie ca- oh, jeez. Eight pieces of gold. No. Armor shop. What do you got? Magic knife? Still can't afford any of this though. Training suit. Okay. What's this? It's like a brain. I got a log. Oh, we can push it. Wow, the strength users will come in handy someday. Oh, is it just showing that we can push stuff around? I bet if I would have talked to him before pushing, he would have said something along the lines of Push that boulder. Uh unicorn horse. Nay. Tools. Got a turban. Can't afford it yet. Did you obtain the thief's key? No. Here there is a cave in the forest south of this village that con connects to this. Okay, so. Which we would, if we follow what we were told earlier, 
about following the ocean, we would get there too. We didn't talk to this guy, did we? When you walk out, oh yeah, we did. Okay, well. There it is. Uh, we can try this real quick. Battle. Two giant anteaters appear. Sudden amounts of attack. So we got a surprise attack. Blaze. Fight. Should be dead. Three giant anteaters. run from this but why we are gonna need to heal here soon It's gone up to four. The other two shouldn't be far behind. Rain dodge, nice. Thank you. 
and medical herb. I was hoping to be able to take that one out in one swing. So this should leave us lead us to that tower. Agility 1, Vitality 2, Luck 1, Intelligence 2, HP went up 5, MP went up 4. That heal, Iggy. Uh, Ned could use a heal. Another chest, and we have two paths to choose from. Three paths. Wayfarer's clothes. Take the bottom path first. should give Rain her level. Ooh, Matt's almost out of MP. Get any HP. Ooh. And she learned a new spell. What spell? Oh. Status info. Upper. We run this time. Jeez. Not getting lucky with runs. Tremendous hit. Dead. Yeah. 
Holy cow. Hey, we finally got to run to work. This is just loop around. Blaze squad. Dang it. Chest, and then no, it didn't lead there. Oh, slimes. So now we must be in that tower. Some stairs on the bottom right, it looks like. Stairs here too. Two frog wars. Oof. Oh, this is not good. Do I really need to be a higher level before I come here? Oh, that's back at the castle, isn't it? Back at the jail. That keys are gonna be a quick way back to save us then. No. Ugh, Ned's gonna need the heal. Tremendous blow of seven. Nice. It didn't kill it. Let's take the bottom stairs that were over here. Let's not explore north. I don't have the HP for it. Masked moths attack suddenly. Awesome. And they have a hard on for net. Oh, I think it's 
might be it. This feels like an important area. God bless. Stairs going down. That surround spell sucks. Thank you. 
I'm gonna level up on Ned. Maybe we did have to go north. Oh shoot, let's go back and save. Or not save, heal. Let's get our MP back. And then, yeah, I guess we're venturing north. Or was there more stuff we could do? Venture North. So we go left. Chest. Thirty-two pieces of gold. That's a good one. So I'm assuming Rain and Mash should be close to leveling up. Big door we can't get through. We don't have a key. What? Where the hell am I? Was there another path to take? Well, now I'm confused. There's Reeve again. Alright, let's go back to the castle and save. So I wonder if I well, if I search that area again, will that allow me to go back? Ooh, I should check that. So this grass spot right here. Oh, I just have to go to it. Good to know. Alright, well, let's back out. It's a lot of slimes. That's what Expel does. It has no effect on slime. Slime, oh, it's just personal. It actually killed them. I guess we'll find out in a second when we see how much experience we get. Four. I don't think we get experience when we expel them. save. Then I guess, yeah, we'll go back into the... I don't think we were truly in the tower yet. Or maybe we were. I don't know. We'll go back to that spot below Reeve and see if there's another way to look. Like a path I missed or some something. See, that dude's in the Tower of Najira. Oh, 
All right, let's let's save. See how close we are to leveling up. I need six more experience. Ned's needs 96. Rain needs 27. Matt needs 14. Okay. Alright, well we're gonna call it there then, guys. Uh, we'll re-explore the... I'm assuming maybe the partial bottom part of the tower and see what we need to do, figure it out. We'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. But we'll do that in the next one. So thanks again for watching. Remember, if you're not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button to follow along with what we do here. Like the video, comment down below what your experiences are with the game. Um, again, I think I mentioned, forgot to mention this at the beginning to follow up. Um, don't just straight tell me what to do. If I'm asking for help, you know, please feel free to, to provide advice then. Um, if you want to talk more, you know, kind of give me some, I guess, something that's not going to help me completely solve stuff. I don't necessarily care, um, but I am trying to play this blind. I don't want just somebody walking me through it. So, uh, but yeah, we'll call it there. Thanks for watching, guys. We will see you in the next one.